So welcome to Wizardry 8, everybody. We are going to do a new concept of a magic damage party. The plan for this party is to try to kill everything using instant kill spells. We'll see if it works out or not. And in terms of the party build, what were we going to use? We were going to use as many Death Wish and Asphyxiation casters as we can. But one thing I was going to do is I was going to use a bunch of the classic builds from the various uh, forum regulars. So we're going to use HOK 1970s Int Speed Wiz Alchemy Bishop. We're going to use G Pope's Half Bishop, Mage Bishop Duel. We're going to use Bio Goo's Pure Gnome Mage. We're going to, in honor of Horpner Sneed, we are going to use a Mage Samurai Duel. I don't know at what level we're going to duel the Mage into Samurai, but we're going to take at least one level of Mage. Probably hold levels. The whole reason I started this thing was to use MP Norman's Strength, Intelligence, Power Cast, Priest build, which I think is a terrible build, but we will see. He keeps saying on the forum, like, don't don't knock something that you haven't tried, so I'm going to try it and see if it works. And then the last thing, uh, Abscondrel wanted to be in the party, so we're going to use a Ranger, and the Ranger's going to be probably our Death's, Death Cloud Quicksand Caster, although we'll have two Alchemy users in the party. So now the question is, and we're running on the 1.28 EXE. So now the question is, what, uh, what starting equipment do we want and what order do we want the party to be in? So the, bishop, the bishops and mages equipment is not important at all. So we'll probably start those as fighters just for extra shields. The ranger's gonna start with a short bow, that's fine. The ranger can take one of the swords uh, from one of the other characters. For the the priest, we want a shield, and MP Norman says go mace. I don't know. I don't know if mace. I don't know if there's a good staff first or there's a good mace first. But I think we're just gonna. We'll probably just create the priest. So this is human. I don't know if MP Norm is a man or a woman, but let's just assume that it's a dude. So Strength, Intelligence, Dex, I think is the build. And then um, what spells is probably he'll make. I know he goes for web at level two. The stamina book's gonna go to the Wizardry Alchemy Bishop. Light's not important. We're gonna put points in fire because I don't I do know that he uses lightning on this priest. But early in the monastery we're just using divine because the main purpose of this character, he's gonna use Guardian Angel against Gregor. So I know he usually recommends putting in points in the weapon skills. I'm gonna put a, at least a little bit into this stuff. Rest in Mace. And since we're on the 1.28, I know there's a bunch of extra portraits. So we'll see if there's anything that looks good for a human male. Yeah, this, this looks like MP Norman. Um... <laughs> what personality is MP Norman? Don't worry about a thing for. By my own. Uh, he's definitely not aggressive or chaotic. He's a very seems like a very welcoming guy. Uh, intellectual. I would be honored to assist your brave band. He actually literally had a post in the forums where he said he would be honored to be included in a party so we're definitely he's gonna be this intellectual guy he's high he's he's going intelligence power cast so all right that's mp norman let's uh let's create the ranger 
Ranger's gonna be Abscondrel. I I I know he's a he's a dude. Um, we're gonna go for a Mook Ranger. So this build is gonna be Strength Dex since we're going for a caster. I don't care about senses. We'll, we'll go Intelligence. And I don't know if we're gonna go for power casts or not. I might go for a late power cast because the idea for this party is that it's gonna go past level 22. So if we get PC late, that's okay. Um, for Rangers in the early game, I like to go to Croc early and get the Greenwood Bow and Precision Arrows. It makes, even on Expert, the Ranger a pretty effective weapon da damage dealer before you get things like Bloodlust and the Dread Spear. Although this could be a Bloodlust Ranger. But at least in the Monastery, we're going to be using bows. So we're going to go Ranged Bow... And what's the weapon? We're either going to go for spears or swords. Yeah, we're going to start with a sword. We're not, we're not going to... Yeah, actually, this guy has to be the tank, so he needs to go sword and shield for sure. And we'll just let shield level on its own that's fine it takes 25 points i think for one point of armor class which is a lot of points invested the other nice thing about the ranger is that you can get the plus three ac cloak from trinton or martin's bluff pretty early let's see if there's any moot portraits Elf portraits. Oh, interesting. <laughs> this is going to be the HOK 1970 portrait for sure. Uh, I feel like this portrait. And there's some great portraits in 1.28. Huh, interesting. Oh, I like the Lizard Man portraits too. Pretty cool. No new tracking portraits. I might go for that dwarf portrait. Uh, let's let's do this. Uh, he's not French. He's American. Yeah, slice him, dice. Yep. What? Uh, I talked to him on the phone, so I know what his voice sounds like. Is ordinary man. <laughs> this is one of my favorite voice lines. Let's make him cunning. Just between you and me, I'm the perfect guy for this job. Okay, so these are two characters where we're going to keep their starting equipment. The other four are going to be mages. So actually, we do want to make a dead samurai that we're going to remake as a, um, as a mage as soon as we start. Just because we might want those samurai swords early on. Sword, shield, close, doesn't matter. This this character is going to be dismissed right away. And then we're going to make three fighters. Just for the extra shields. I'm just going to go 
sword and shield on all these guys. And we'll need two more. whatever just make sure he gets a shield I think fighters get shields no matter what fighter human okay this is fine sword shield close yep all of them Okay, so what what uh, what order do we want to put the party in? I know I want the ranger in position six. He's gonna stay on thirty-five speed, and will for mo he'll be using bloodlust for maybe part of the game, but most of the game he's gonna use non-cursed weapons. So it's fine if he goes last. He's gonna be getting cleanup kills with extended range, either a dread spear or a giant sword and a bow. MP Norman is never going to use a cursed weapon. He will probably go in position 5. So he's going to go in strength dex, no speed either, so he'll be slow. So I think position 5 is going to be the priest, position 6 is going to be the ranger. I generally like to have my dedicated spellcasters on positions 1, 2, and 3. So the samurai is going to go in position 4. Now the only question is in what order do I want to put the three casters? Just from muscle memory, I usually like to have my main spellcaster on one, which maybe is going to be the pure bishop, and then the half bishop on two, and then Bayugu, who is the pure mage, is going to be on three. So this guy's getting replaced, this guy's getting replaced, this guy's getting replaced, this guy's getting replaced by the samurai, this guy's going to be on five, this guy's going to be on six. So that's, that's our party. And let's kick it off. Expert difficulty, simplified, simplified, I don't even know what this does. Not Iron Man. It saves scum a lot for certain items. Okay. Uh, yeah, we are gonna remake these guys. So this dude, move all his gear. This is all not bad equipment for a bishop. We're going to make the HOK elf in speed bishop now. So this guy goes intelligence max. I know it's five points in piety. He leaves piety at 60. Speed to 55 and then the question is what's the last stat that we want to raise i think he might be going one point in senses he either goes senses or dexterity most likely i wouldn't actually mind the extra hit points but points spent in vitality are probably better later on so i think uh, since this is an initiative character i think we're just going to go for points and senses, although Dex would make alchemy climb a bit faster. I think the effect's really small, so it doesn't matter. So this is standard energy blast healing. So wizardry, alchemy, and fire. Maybe three, two, something like that. That's good. And his name is HOK1970. Okay, portrait, we're gonna go. <laughs> this is, these portraits are great. Uh, we're gonna go for this, this bishop guy right here. And why do the voice lines not work? I hope this is not a 1.28 bug. We can always change these later. Let's just go with this. 
Yep. Replace forever. We do not want starting equipment for a bishop. This is going to be the G Pope. Uh, the G Pope half bishop. So starting with one level as mage is going to be the build. Dueling to bishop at level two and then taking 11, 11 levels in bishop. And this is going to be int senses. And the main point he said of this build is to have. Um, the main point of this build is to have. We have to get the uh, bishop minimums. But the, the primary purpose of developing the character like this in the first place is to have a second good offensive realm on, on um, a mage. So the, the whole purpose of the build is to add eco width to a mage. So we're going to go probably wizardry psionics. And I will train divinity and alchemy if I can. It's gonna, it's gonna be getting alchemy to forty is gonna be difficult. But then getting, so we're gonna have to put points in it in the mid levels. But then probably from around like level nine or so, we'll be able to get to forty alchemy and then power level it. So I'll take the level 12 level up, I'll just probably pick all the level 5 alchemy spells that I need, like Purify Air and Body of Stone. I know G-Pope usually does take Body of Stone on those casters. Now the question is, do I want 60 Dexterity or do I want 60 Piety? I actually like the Piety, so we'll go with this. And then subsequent points are going to be in Senses. And as a mage, we are going to take Energy Blast and Frost, although we could save the level 2 pick, but that's fine. Wizardry, Fire, Water is what we're doing. Mental is really easy to power train, and I'm going to probably do some training for it in Arnica with Divine Trap. Okay, so he's an elf. I go with this, this face, it's hilarious. Oh, actually, no, this, this is gonna be Biogu. It's gonna be the gnome. Halfling portraits are not bad. Uh, lizard men. The lizard men portraits are cool. G Pope also had a fairy mage build, but I don't want to use that one. one. Uh, this is hilarious. Uh, maybe. Yeah, I don't like these elf portraits. We're gonna go f with either the human or the dwarf. This guy looks like a Chad. G Pope's a Chad. And uh, what is he? So 
sounds like these these voice lines are not working anyway. Nope, don't want equipment for a mage. This is gonna be this is gonna be the Biogu pure mage. So let's remove all this junk. Place mage goes for a gnome int piety vitality energy blast frost simple This actually looks kind of like Biogu. We're gonna go with this this picture. Nope, no gear. This is gonna be the Horkner Sneed Samurai Mage. So we have the samurai equipment in case we want to use it. We probably won't use it, but we have it. Gonna be he goes human. But what are the samurai minimums? So we need 50, 55, 50, 55, 55. So 50. And then the rest is in strength dex. So 72. Okay, go like that. So I think what we're gonna do here is this guy's gonna go for power cast on intelligence and we'll split this points evenly between strength and dexterity for the rest. Let's see if this character is good. Energy Glass Frost. Wizardry Fire Water. This is a human, right? can be he can be this aggressive this French guy nope what is the 310 equipment biogu HOK G Pope okay great all right so let's equip all our gear this guy you're gonna get I have a little equipment stacking mod, which I might install. It basically lets you stack ammunition to 250 and lets potions stack to 25, so it's just like less inventory clutter. You might have to install that. Fur lighting is plus four. What is this thing? Okay, sweet pants. Upgrade. Sway Duble. We'll take the leather curios. Rangers ready. Priest, you get a shield as well. You're gonna get heavier armor as well. Keep your mace. 
Mage, mage, mage. This is the bishop. So this guy's gonna get a shield. We'll get a leather cuirass as well. Use this thing, this thing. Okay, so the bishop is gonna have decent equipment. The mages, I'm gonna get these. And let's save. I'm gonna call this um, Death Wish Party. Um, beach. By all the powers of darkness, this is a fine situation to be in. What is this place? Where are we? Yeah, that's right, it's okay. Hold off. Or my hotkey's not working. Select PC number one. Why is that not working? You bellowed? Okay, got a spear, that's nice. Got some rocks. Give these to MP Norman. Get a hat. Spear. Well, maybe we're gonna go sword and bone for now. Okay, the ranger is gonna be our frontliner. Yes. What's up? The priest. Wow, this is gonna be a really squishy party. So the bishop is sort of a tank. The you bellowed. Three mages have to go in the middle. So let's see if we can even. Yes. Okay, there we go. The very hot. Let the combat commence. Energy blast. Taken care of. Energy blast. Okay. So I think uh, MP Norman has his Understood. magic parties rest a lot. Let's heal. The hotkeys are a little bit different in the, uh, in the, I think split stack identifying does not work in, oh, it does. I think there was a version of 1.28 that they nerfed the split stack identify. Yeah, you can't recombine, but it looks like the split stack still works, so we might grind that a little bit later. Need mana, for sure. So this I learned from Biogu that this is a safe place to rest. Although not having a bard in the party is gonna suck. I hate long resting. We're not gonna fight the crabs yet. We'll just get through the slimes and get the book and all that, that good stuff. Danger grows here like a weed. Is that right, Ryugu? You Let's should just cherry bottom comments. all this your way through and all this stuff. Equals. Understood. Oh, I need to put everybody on defend. Cannot be attained. I love energy blast. It's so strong. Wow, 
Oh. HOK, come on, dude. Kill this thing. Okay. Abscondrel's gonna die. Taken care of. It shall be so. On the Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's let's uh, let's reload this. Did we rest? We did rest. We need to put all of the mages Taken on care defend of. so they don't waste their rounds. Okay. It shall be so. Avec plaisir. Understood. Okay, the ranger can auto attack. Everybody else is casting. Wait a minute. I think we're being lured into something here. Is that right, up scoundrel? Okay. Taken care of. Okay. It shall be so. It shall be so. Understood. Guys, kill it. Come on. What are you waiting for? Actually, we're gonna have our priest heal. Understood. Bishop's already out of mana. This guy can okay. switch to frost. This guy still has mana. This is what we're seeing. So he's still got mana. Our will has prevailed. Nice, 71 quarrels. It's pretty nice. Uh, one nasty thing about this party is that we are not going to have a uh, triple shot crossbow. It's disappointing unless I pick up Madras and grind him, which I don't want to do. I love triple shot crossbows. Okay, yes. We can have our bishop train healing. Yes. Worked. Nice. care of no nope. you are nuking taken care of our will has so do we have enough mana and damage to beat the noxious slime I think we do a great conflict awaits. Okay. It shall be so. So MP9. It shall be so. There's out of mana. Cast frost. Oh, that was a crash. 1.28 issue. Let's try again. I might have to remake this party on the regular EXE because one thing I've noticed about 1.28 is that the save files don't transfer. They're not backward compatible. Oh well, death waits for us all. Taken care of. Okay. It shall be so. 
Macramundus Poranzio! He's a shark! It shall be so. Hola, Podrida! Decamundo! Understood. It shall be so. He's a shark! Bishops out of mana. This guy still has mana. Okay. It shall be so. Macaramundus Poranzio! Why is, why is he out of range? It shall be so. This guy still has frost mana. Let it be so. Okay, there we Our go. Will has prevailed. Horkner Sneed learned a little bit about wizardry. That's nice. What's up? Actually, we have a ranger, so he should auto find all this. Hey, food. look! I must have dropped that. Yeah, nice work. Hey, look! I must have dropped that. Okay, light book. Who's getting this? I think. Oh yeah, this is amazing. Yeah, uh, nothing special. Who needs uh, more yeah, fire probably mana? Worthless. I'll just uh, hang on to it for us. So I, a lot of times I give the light book to the uh, to the wizardry alchemy bishop, so it can have a stronger blinding light going into the Gregor fight. But I think I'm going to go up to level four with this party before I fight Gregor. So I don't think the extra fireman is that important. I probably. Well, Biogu's gonna get tons of fire training anyway. Horpner Sneed, I guess, could use it, but he's gonna duel. I, I, I'm pretty sure MP Norman and his magic damage party, he has the priest learn it to just start training some fire mana. But fire, extra fire mana is useless on a priest in the early game. I'd rather have it on somebody that needs it. These two guys are going to be magic missile spammers. He's going to be using fireball. This guy, I would like to use this to train alchemy, but I'm probably going to have to use stamina and blinding flash to train alchemy and healing. Did I put points into alchemy? Yes, I did. Um, otherwise, it's just going to give him wizardry skill ups. I don't want wizardry skill ups on him. This guy is also going to have no problem raising wizardry. It's going to be over leveled. So, who gets this? Uh. I guess HOK gets it. Who's going to get the the priest books and the, who's going to get the bless book? MP Norman will get the, the bless book and, and probably also the divine trap. So he's going to be a strong caster. I can just power train divine trap on him. Those are not going to help me get psionics. Well, actually, I could have divine trap on this guy, but I'm going to train divine trap and probably an arm on both of these guys. And maybe on him too. Doesn't matter who gets the book. Nobody's gonna learn it. Actually, MP Norman's gonna get the Divine Trap book too because I want him to be able to identify all the potions that this guy mixes. Excellent. So that's fine. Yes. And he actually needs the mana. So let's take a look at Nice, got a fire mana. Level up. Let's rest. Some slimes. Worthy opponents. Taken care of.
Why is this stuff still out of range? Okay. And if people are not familiar with my gameplay style, I have a bunch of speed mods installed, so that's why the the combat runs go a lot faster than on some of the wizardry streams you may have seen from other people. One nice thing about this party is that the split stack artifacts grinding is going to be really easy because everybody has high intelligence. What's here? More stuff! I'll get it. Yeah, you will. Would be nice stuff. if I I'll had a triple it. shot crossbow in this party. I think the slings are by where the bridge is, so I don't have any missile attacks on this party other than the ranger's bow. We'll have healing potions. Usually just go. Never reach. Um. Taking care. I'll be so. Standing by. Ah, how exquisite. Okay, this is another noxious. Look, line. it's alive. Why? Taking oh, care. I'll be so. Understood. Okay. Understood. Our victory was never in doubt. We're gonna need to rest. Let's grab the hey, stamina. Look, I must have dropped that. Stamina book, and then we'll rest after that. Oh, one other thing I didn't mention about my ammo mod. It lets you mix. Okay, this we'll definitely need. It lets you mix different types of ammo to create other ones. So if you get, like when you get too many sling stones and too many arrows, you can mix them to make corals. Basically, you can't make money doing this because hey, everything's look, tailored to create ammunition that's of equal value. But it, uh, it lets you get the kind of ammo you need for your party without wasting a lot of time refreshing vendors. This is definitely going to the alchemy guy. Excellent. And so basically what I do to train alchemy is I will like run around a little bit, go into battle, and then do something like this. Taken care of. And so he'll get he'll get a skill up from that. And that's enough. When you get uh, when you gain a few levels and you have a little bit of water mana, you can cast PL7 stamina pretty easily, and get a fair number of alchemy skill ups just from that, and water skill ups too. Just before you rest, just dump your water mana pool. Forty-five minutes. Let's see if I can get through the lower monastery, and I will stop streaming after that. What's in here? This is the ring of protection, right? More stuff. Oh, yeah, you need it, dude, because you're getting lit up. Let's do a bit of split stack grinding.
it's actually better to wait to do this until I get some skill ups and have higher intelligence it just makes it go faster. It's not worth it to get, I think, to 18 right away. A few skill ups here and there don't matter. You can, I think, make the rest of the skill ups up on just the, the split stack identifying. What's, what am I missing here? Oh, boots. What is this? This is good. Actually, I want to rest. I never fight the roaches. I always save them in case I need them for stealth grinding, which, granted, I've not done stealth grinding in probably 10 years, but I'm always like, just in case I need it. Actually, the best place to grind stealth is on the Seekers in the upper monastery in the, the control room area. As their chance to hit's really low, you can just... Put everybody on defend and they'll never hit or kill anyone. Oh, I wanted to go get the noxious slime, right? I learned about the glory of finding more stuff. I'll get it. Fighting these uh, noxious slimes from Biogoose speedruns or his challenge playthroughs. Just a really high value source of XP. I'm sad to say that the odds are Take against us. Oh, shall be so. Understood. Oops. We're not supposed to cast stamina. Taken care of. Yes. Actually, this guy needs to be casting energy blast. Oh wow. Heal wounds. Make wounds does nothing against it. Yes. Yeah. How wonderful. Wonderful. I'm making my mark. Nice job, G Pope. Experience is the best teacher. Splodded. I become, I become even, even more, more deadly. deadly. My aptitude increases. I'd rather be recognized with cash, but a rise in stats. <laughs> Man, I love the voice lines in this game. Okay, so level up. This guy is turning into a bishop. Half bishop. He's going to go int and senses. Yeah, I'm sure. He's taking heal, I think, nothing else. So this is, these half bishops are a little bit weird, so they're not gonna get magic missile until level four. And I don't think I'm gonna have my bishops casting the mage buffs. I'm gonna have probably my pure mage casting the mage buffs. So he needs to go psionics. He needs to go continue raising wizardry because we need fireball. And he can start raising divine for a magic missile. Because fire and water's really good already. So Biogu is simple. He's in piety all the way. He's going to save his pick. And he's going to go, we don't need mental or air. Eventually he's going to need to pump air because he's going to he's going to be the dedicated asphyxiation caster in this party. We'll go wizardry fire, water socks for a while. At least this raises 
I don't actually know what Biogu does with this mage on, on level 2. At least Noxious Fumes would give us... But I don't... I think he usually buys that from a book. Okay, whatever. Offensive mana. So this guy, we might duel to Samurai, but we're gonna wait. We're gonna see if we actually need his levels. MP Norman is Strength Int. Uh, he's he's going to save picks. I know MP Norman likes to go for web on level 2, so I think we're going to go for web and Guardian Angel. And he cannot start putting points in... Mental, we're going to grind. So Divine, we need. Divinity, I don't know at what level he stops putting points in Divinity. I think he said that basically this build doesn't need a lot of points invested there with the 25% bonus. I think the main thing is that we just want to be able to get... Well, basically, as soon as I start grinding, then this thing's going to skyrocket. So then I'll just put points in the weapon and armor skills. And I think eventually he's going to use a mauler. Abscondrel, he's going to go strength dex. He's our tank. And he's going to go sword, bow. Do you actually need points in scouting? Does anybody know? Does this do anything? I never know. Okay. Take a quick rest. Oh, actually, I needed to be. Sp I need to be spamming light. Whatever. Okay, bastard sword. That's not bad. Two to eight. Bastard is. Oh, rangers can't use bastard swords. Oh, potentially this is a weapon for. Poser's cap. I was gonna. H O K is a poser. So this might be eventually a samurai weapon. So basically, since we're not leveling up this mage at all, this is almost like having a five-man party with a slower experience gain. We'll see if it works. In my experience, at least if you can make it to the upper, upper monastery, having two magic missile bishops is so strong that it doesn't matter what the rest of your party is. And in this party, we're actually going to have three. So we should be able to just absolutely d destroy most ah, of the fights. A creature. Okay, these are level two roaches. These guys will be pushover. Taken okay. care. Okay. Be so. easy. Understood. Shaka. Taken care. Shaka. Okay. Nice, Abscondrel. Beware. My power grows stronger. So, HOK, what's he doing? He is intelligence speed, which I hate. I wish I could be raising vitality, but that's not the build. And he's going to take Blinding Flash and Magic Missile at level 3, so he's saving the pick. So we need Alchemy for sure. Yeah, we're gonna... Yeah, he needs this, because he's gonna go towards Fireball. And he needs Blinding Flash and Magic Missile. It's 
so he has enough for blinding flash. I actually care more about getting to knock knock than I do about getting to fireball on this guy. Because I'm going to have two fireball casters on Arnica Road. So I only need to go to 15 wizardry because G Pope and Biogu are going to have fireball. And it's okay if this guy just uses magic missile for cleanup, I think. Uh, let's do this. I know fire magic's more important for getting through Gregor, so I want to keep that leveled. Taken care of. Ola Podrida. Before we rest, we'll cast light as well. Let's get lost here. This is where the crab is. So who's the poser? HOK is the poser, right? So one nice thing about having these shield users is between the poser's cap and the thieves buckler, you actually have plus 20 blocks and traps. So if you're playing one of these challenge playthroughs, like the shields are really underrated. There's a, a lot of passive bonuses that are pretty good, some of them. The plus 10 speed and 10% lock picking, quite nice. Sounds like there's a bog of some kind in there. Wow, this is annoying. There we go. Under control. Never reach. Taken care of. A battle? Taken oh, care of. Under control. control. I don't know how Biogu does these like. Oh shit. Like, that's not what I wanted to do. I think the priest, we're gonna need his mana for healing. Save our ranger. On the street. Might need the bishop for do some healing too. Okay. It shall be How much damage have we done with this guy? It shall be so. Nice. At least these guys are... Okay. The mages are hitting hard. It shall be so. Understood. Okay, Frost. It shall be so. Can you guys get a kill on this dude, please? Okay. Uh, I'm taking a beat in here. Does anybody have mana left? 
Okay, you just defend. Man, I'm I'm there we go. Oh, that was close. How exquisite. There's some loot here, right? I think there's some hidden bows and arrows and stuff in this place. I might just want to have um, the ranger just defend. Aren't there some corals or a crossbow or something around? More stuff. There I'll we go. get it. I don't think we have mana to deal with this fight. We need some pots. Okay. These guys will be pushing. Okay. This time, care you're going to cast Blocked. 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 And you're going to cast Heal okay. Blast. You're going to cast it shall be so Blast. And you're going to cast Peel Blast. Blocked. Worthy opponents. Priest's gonna be on him. Okay, empty man, you start healing. The hotkeys are really weird. I don't know why he like, doesn't select the character that I wanted to select. Okay. He's out of mana. It shall be so. Taken care of. Okay, is out of mana. Okay. Understood. Why is this almost out of mana? It shall be so. Taken care of. Our will. Okay, so some roach is coming. We can actually go through here and rest in the noxious slime room. It'd be easier. Oh, I'm supposed to. Do you have mana for light? No, oh, right. Let's cast a fake stamina too. Taken care of. Accidents will happen. Yeah, so this is this is why it's good to do it on the fake battle. I'll still get skill ups for that. This is where we need magic Behold, missiles. The valley of death. Huh. Well, 
What level are these guys? Their hit points suck. Taken care of. Okay. Wonder if we have enough of to get through this fight. It shall be so. Avec plaisir. If we had a Draken, this this fight would also be trivial. Also, our Drakens are really good. Yes. Just rest. I think those monsters are still going to be there. Oh, they're not. Oh shit. Here they are. Here's at least the roaches. A battle? Roaches we can deal with by the way. Taken care of. Okay. Taken care of. Understood. Katralana, avec plaisir. Our will has prevailed. Getting some nice skill ups. for burrs. Okay, nice. Sling. So in MP Norman's, uh, in his magic damage parties, he usually has his int senses guys, which I think is his mage and his psionic. He has them develop as slingers, which I probably will do eventually, but right now it's too tedious. So I'm not going to bother to... I'm basically going to wait until I have double shots or risk rockets to let these guys take attacks with their... Ah, now what do you suppose this is for? Okay, so burrs... We, can... we have to first... An entity approaches. I read a trick, I think it was from... Abscondrel, that he usually leaves these fishes alive to spam terror and all that. I don't know if it matters that much. I'm realizing we might have to level up this mage. I don't know to mage or samurai uh, for the extra damage against Gregor because he's not going to do anything. 
We'll see. Maybe at level four we can get through. I'm not sure. And we'll have Guardian Angel too. I'm probably going to play until we beat Gregor. And then I'll stop this because I've already been going for over an hour. And I have a uh, coaching client at three. How many did we get? Oh, I only got one. How disappointing. Yes. Oh, yeah, does that wizardry skill up is actually not what I want. I want uh, alchemy skills. Taken care of. There you go. Got a water magic skill. Let's rest. Actually, we can have MP more by. practice some of his healing. Impossible, I'm afraid. Yes. This guy can practice his healing too. What, what level Biogu usually fights these guys? With a normal party, beating them at level two is not that hard. With this hey, party, look, I must have dropped that. This party, I'm not sure. We'll slap them sideways. Taken care of. Okay, it's heavy easy. Song. I must have dropped that. Hey, look, I must have dropped that. Cherry bomb's nice, but nobody's leveling throwing. I wonder if I should have gone for throwing on the MP Norman Priest, because he has no source of magic damage until... Uh, Actually, I think I might do that. It's sort of a mistake to already lose the eight points, but I'm gonna I'm gonna let him auto attack. Start auto attacking with rocks. And I'm gonna have him maybe not against Gregor because he needs to save his his casts, but for regular fights. 
He's going to be... Too, his, his throwing and sling is too low now to be useful on Arnica Road, but if I level it up, it might be useful elsewhere. And he has... He literally has no magic damage until... Mm. Or no significant magic damage until Whirlwind. Whirlwind is really bad. Understood. Taken care of. Okay, let's see if we can make it to Burrs now. I need some more XP. I'm gonna find all those noxious slimes. My my plan for this samurai actually is to see if I can make it out of the monastery without taking a single level on him. And so then I will duel him straight to samurai six and his magic will never turn off. And then he can just play as if he was an underleveled mage with a lot of extra HP. I think the biggest problem of the samurai leveling is that during that dead period where they don't have their magic activated, they can't gain skill in it, even from casting low level spells. So I want to circumvent that entirely if I can. At least that's the hope. Observe a creature. Okay, let's see what this guy has for us. Who might that be? Was that you? What do these colors mean? Yes. Oh, is it? Okay, so white is weapons, brown is consumables, red is things I can't afford, green is armor. So I might want to buy this buckler for G Pope. I think he doesn't have a Come shield. Back in yeah, he does not. I want to buy a buckler. Cheerio! And then sort this. I can definitely sell one of the bows. So sling. Actually, I, I can keep the bow because this guy is going to duel to samurai. And he can use it after that. The bastard sword, minus one, minus three. I would rather use the katana, probably, so I can sell the bastard sword. Spear. I don't know if I, I probably don't need it on him, so I can sell that. So who should have the second sling? Usually MP Norman gives it to a uh, Int Sen guy, which this guy is. So he can potentially both of these guys can sort of train auto attacks. I don't know how he gets decent skills on sling without raising strength or dexterity, though. Seems like it wouldn't work. This guy's going strength dex, so he's, he can just be an archer. He's never going to make an attack, and he's never going to make an attack. So that's fine. Light crossbows I hate to sell because I always save them for triple shots, so I might actually hang on to this and just dump it in the chest in case I ever need it later. Okay. Don't need this, don't need this. Why is this unidentified? Don't need the spear. That I'll keep. Don't need these. Usually I can keep all these consumables for mixing. Oh, actually, I can. If I have medium heals, I can start mixing potions at 15 alchemy. Is the 
buckler. Come back in. Cheerio. There you go, buddy. Man, Burrs is kind of disappointing. Not really that much good here. So I definitely cannot beat Gregor at level 2. So I gotta go look for some more XP around here somewhere. And I can't drop down because I'll just die. So this is always the tricky thing is how do you get back to the lower monastery after you come up to Burrs? I pick up everything individually, just so if I want to split stack identify it, I can. Okay, so there's a fight with those those AOE roaches. I hate taking that fight though without magic missile. It's really annoying. So I gotta get some XP from somewhere. I might just run back down using the bio goo cheats. Taken care of. Under control. There we go. Shoo, shoo, go away. Okay, and then I think he just he just farms noxious slimes down here for a while. Taken care of. Taken care of. Okay. It shall Use be so. Energy blast where we can. Avec plaisir. And actually, MP Norman is going to practice fighting too. Understood. I don't know why I have so little XP on the party. Usually I'm level 3 or 4 by the time I get to the monster. I've just not gotten good monsters to fight against. Okay. Okay. One other annoying thing is that the uh, auto select next character never works. So I have to left hand select my characters, right hand press my hotkey for cast last spell. My aptitude increases. There we go. It does indeed, MP Norman. All right. Magic missile. Oh, he actually needs to be our buff caster oh we're, we're going to level four so no big deal wait who do who do i want to do what the yeah okay, so this this guy is taking at level he's going to take blinding flash and magic missiles this guy's going to take Oh, he's got he's got mage level, so he can. Th these two guys are going to be my buff casters. So by a goo, the only question is who's taking what. So air magic. Does he have points in divine? Yeah, he's three points. So he's going to go. He's going to be the divine guy. He's going to be the air guy. So you're gonna go air divine and wizardry. Eventually, we're not gonna need to put points on wizardry anymore. MP Norman. So he, I know he takes web. I'm gonna go guardian angel and web. 
and we're gonna go divine earth oh yeah we're gonna go throwing right I think this is probably unrecoverable but What do priests have at level five that is really important? Rest all I can get from a book and I won't need it on Arnica Road. It's not that important. What else is it? Armor plate? I guess I could learn armor plate and he's gonna be, armor plate's also not that important. Magic screen? Important, but not important at level five. I guess he could learn them and just start training. That's gonna be the value. Yeah, this this thing's never gonna get fixed. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Oh, right. Taken care of. Nice, got water magic. Yes. Oh, right. Okay, I didn't get it. That's fine. Actually, might as well rest. Let's hope that there's something good to fight somewhere in here. Here comes something. We shall utterly obliterate them. Man, these guys are all trash. Taken care of. Okay. Let it be Let it be We want to have him start casting and training web. Understood. I never boast, but uh, damn, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, you are good. Okay. Let's go. Understood. Wonderful. I'm making my mark. What is this? I'd rather be recognized with cash, but a rise in status will do. Oh, a mace. Nice. And what is this thing? Fur leggings. Quilt armor. Who can use this? Okay, G Pope is in Sen. And why is he missing the spell pick? Oh, because I took Energy Blast Frost. That was a mistake. He needs to be using Enchanted Blade, but I'd rather have Magic Missiles. Yeah, he needed to save the pick. Psionics, Wizardry, and Divine. Sword bow ranged. Z 
This battle will be child's okay, play. Okay. Oh, actually, we have we have magic missile. Okay. Understood. Actually, that red pick was so Okay. Beware, my power grows stronger. So, what level is everybody? We need to for maximum noxious slime spawns. We're supposed to be. He's level one. Three, 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 two. Did I already mess this up? I may have. Yeah, average party level is supposed to be level two for... Will be child. Take it. Okay. Have it easy. Understood. Okay. It shall be so. Okay, this is not, This is gonna get ugly. Okay. Taken care of. 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 Taken Psionic is not getting any training in his healing, unfortunately. How long do we need to rest to see if there's new encounters? Oh, I can actually go fight the big roach room. So I have magic missile now. Yes. Or maybe I can just stop the recording now. It's Wanted to at least get through Gregor. But I need monsters to fight. I don't think this party can beat Gregor at level 3, which is why I want to go to level 4. Oh, there we go. Certainly Nine software. Holy crap. Taken care of. That is ugly. Okay. Understood. 
Oh that God. Did he waste his mana on white? Taken care of. <laughs> Dude, this web is good. Web is no joke. Dude, MP Norman is onto something. Taken care of. I never use this spell. And are we on expert difficulty? Yeah, we're on expert. Okay. G Pope is kicking ass. It shall be so. Corpner Sneed is uh, useless. Although not his fault, because I'm not allowed to use level up. HRK, what are you doing? You're out of mana, dude. Understood. Oh. Nice. Yeah. Actually, we can cast stamina. Even while we want stamina. Taken care of. Taken care of. You shall reach. Uh, Understood. Wabi shall be so. It shall be so. Taken care of. Oh, yes. control. You will never get the kill if you act like that. This. Oh god. Run away. Mana. I need magic missile mana. And then I can kill those guys. I must rest in the arms of sleep. Stop whining, H okay. What is this? Battle will be child's play. Okay. Oh, I've got it shall missile shield. Shall. Should be training that. Rescue this. Understood. Who's hurt? Heal this guy. Okay. Might I suggest some rest? Quite beneficial, you know. Back to normal again. It's kind of interesting having these different mix of wizardry casters and seeing how the four different builds perform. So, so far, uh, the G Pope build is really performing well. And the Biogoo build is pretty good too. Okay, 
Where are we? Where did those roaches go? I kill them if we can. How do, how often is Bayugu rest to reset all these encounters? Feels like it's taken forever. I usually just run through all the stuff. Don't take any extra time here. More stuff! I'll get it. Oh, nice. Uh, the respawns are after three rests, right? Three full rests? Okay, here we go. Oh, wow. A lot of garbage here. Where do I want to take this fight? Look, it's alive. Are they just all green slimes? Yes. This, is this battle will be child's play. Trash fight. Taken care of. Almost not even worth the time. Okay. Oh, that wouldn't be prudent. It shall be so. Okay. Understood. And it Taken care of. Okay. Understood. What is your will? Drop something. Rocks. Okay. Where did it go? Please give me something to fight. Where are the, all the monsters? Just let's just take a full restaurant. Yes, understood. Impossible, I'm afraid. Yes, the very hordes of hell could go oh, right. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and take the level up on this guy. Because I want Magic Missile and I want Blinding Flash. So I can start training Alchemy. I don't care if I, get to, if I don't get to 30 Wizardry by level 5. Alchemy is more important. And if I need an AoE, well, he's going to have magic missiles, but I can always get Noxious Fumes or Whipping Rocks too, so it's not critical. And I don't think it's going to be a problem. There's a lot of fights on Arnica Road that I would take normally that I can skip here, because I don't need the piercing pipes and all that stuff. Okay. Oh. Supposed to. A votre service. You bellow. What is your wish? Magic. Nice.
Yeah, taken care of. This shall be so. We'll do one yes. more round. Taken care of. What? This shall be so. And then uh, we will look for more monsters. This shall be so. Yes. Taken care of. Man, both of them fizzled. Useless. Oh, and now since we have uh, alchemy higher than fire on this guy, or alchemy higher than wizardry on this guy, his light casts will be training alchemy. Man, I need to stop. Oh, here's a big pile of junk. There we go. We will certainly prevail. Yeah, dude. Thanks okay. to you, Chico. You and Biogu are gonna carry this fight. It shall be so. These clowns, useless. Avec plaisir. All right, NPN. Let's see what you can do. Understood. Ooh, blinding flash. Actually, this <laughs> this is gonna drag the Taking fight out. Taken care but... of. Oh! Wow! Landed on everybody. Okay. This is the power of magic in Wizardry 8. See, Horpner, if you focused on your job instead of trying to be a samurai, this is what you could accomplish. <laughs> Taken care of. Oh, the chase goes on. Oh, what did we pull? Actually, I should save my. It shall be so. Avec plaisir. Still has a webcast left. I might save it. I should have given uh, stones to my bishop so I can uh, auto attack. How much divine mana do I have? One cast on him. One cast on him. One webcast. I have two. Oh, he has magic missiles too. Forgot about that. Taken care of. I want the rest of this trash to join this fight before I start wasting a lot of valuable mana. Okay. It shall be so. Decamondo! Okay. Taken care of. Okay. It shall be so. Taken no. care of. You can frost. Avec plaisir. Fire can just nuke. It deserves now. It shall be so. Ah. Ooh. Got heal. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of on this low level mage. He just gets one shotted. Now there's more garbage. Okay. Double magic missile this. Taken care of. Yeah, Biogu's just gonna be. It shall be so. Oh, that is a noxious. It shall be so. 
Podrida. Nice. Still Taken bad. care of. Okay. He now needs to. Taken. We gotta. Care we gotta push this control. Gotta burst down the noxious slimes. That's okay. exactly what I'm doing. Dude, this priest is not bad. I usually never use this class, but you don't need a full power energy. Okay. I am covered with cuts and bruises. Understood. Nice. You know what? Let's just blind you fat flash just for the hell of it. Take it off. Okay. And it shall be so. Cannot be attained. It shall be so. Nice. Decamundo! Okay. Wow, yeah. Taken care of. Dora Podrida. Okay. It shall be so. Taken wow. care of. Okay. He's out of fire. Dude, G Pope is doing okay. okay. I should check the kill counts. It shall be so. <laughs> Too bad. Okay, so this is. I, I think this, like. This whole mage thing's not gonna work. Exquisite. Beware. My power grows stronger. I think I have to do something with this. Wonderful. I'm making my mark. Experience is the best teacher. My aptitude increases. I'd rather be recognized with cash, but a rise in status will do. And this poor guy missed out on all the XP as well. Anyway, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna probably pause it here and then just decide what I want to do later. So. Thank you all for watching this iteration of Wizardry 8. And I'm out for now. Thank you.